The 530 News continues on Q2, Montana's news leader. Tonight we meet an Australian illustrator who became the artist that made memories in all of our living rooms on Saturday mornings. q to Zoe Zandora introduces us to animator Ron Campbell who's showing us his work at a local gallery here in Billings. I was obsessed with the idea of drawings that come alive and uh, went to art school and when I came out, as luck would have it, television had just arrived in Australia and I was able to pretend I knew how to make cartoon films the Rugrats, Scooby-Doo, the Jetsons, and even the Beatles. From the TV screen to the canvas, Ron Campbell helps bring our childhood memories to life. do very bright, happy uh, paintings because um, uh, they're based on bright and happy cartoons. Mm -hmm. Every Saturday morning, pour yourself a glass of milk, maybe have a bowl of cereal, roll out of bed, into the living room, and turn on the television. There's a good chance one of the many cartoons Ron Campbell has worked on was one of your favorites growing up. Rats, well, I gave up almost 10 years of my life to the Rugrats. I love that show, yeah. It's wonderful. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Reptile. <laughs> yeah, Reptile, yeah. And Angelica, I loved Angelica. Whether it be directing or animating, Campbell was a force in animation for five decades. He started his animation career in the late 50s, soon working on shows like Crazy Cat, Cool McCool, and was a director on the successful TV cartoon series, The Beatles. First job was a, a bug spray spraying a, a, a centipede. And I sat there doing 100 drawings of a centipede, and each drawing had 100 little legs on it. And I sat there as a young man thinking, they don't know it, but I would pay them to let me do this. You know? Working in cartoons and now creating original watercolor paintings, Campbell says it allows him to see how nostalgic his paintings really are to those who grew up watching the cartoons. First time I'm meeting the audience, uh, the audience was always just numbers on a page, but now in my retirement I'm actually meeting the audience and discovering just how deep the affection people have for their childish memories of watching cartoons on Saturday mornings. Campbell says he doesn't have a favorite show that he worked on through the years, but he does have a few characters he enjoyed. Any Smurf, okay. <laughs> Papa Smurf, um, Scooby-Doo, George of the Jungle, many characters really. In Billings, Zoe Zandora, MTN News. Scooby-Doo, my kids love him too, and the Smurfs, that yeah. was fun. Well, Ron will be at the Toucan Gallery on Montana Avenue all weekend if you would like to meet him.